Hello and welcome back to Kerbal Space Program. So this is a day late, but only because some really cool things have been being made and there's so many awesome projects that are getting ready. Y you guys will see them and they are pretty amazing. They, they... You'll see. There will be a trailer soon for one thing, I'll just say that. So, where were we? I, I don't even remember. So, we had to launch another probe and land on the moon. Okay. So, um, that is a uh, general statement. Does it mean, like, land a person or just a thing? Land a vessel. Oh, so we don't even have to land a person. Let's do it. This is it. I I thought it was a person at first. That's why I was going to wait, but um apparently not. So this will be the probe and it will have a science thingy majiggy on it and it'll have a comms unit so that can send data back to Earth. A thermometer. Actually, we'll put two on so that we can measure at different Distance isn't actually we'll put three. This is just gonna be like a super science mission. We're gonna get tons of science. It's going to be super. <laughs> Thus the super science. I'll go there. Okay, that looks oh I broke it for a second, but it's fine now. Um in case that broke it, hello and welcome. Uh, but I don't think it did. So we don't even need to worry about food. We just have to worry about electricity. So we will put lots of batteries on. Oh. Gosh. Messing everything up. There we go. That should be enough batteries to last a century. And then some solar panels to get more. That looks pretty good already. But we need to add more so that it can, like, land. <laughs> it's always a good thing when it lands. Um. So, let's give it some. That may be a bit too much to put on the that. To, um. Where's that? That. That's a good size. The final lander will be this. And it will have this little thingy on the bottom here. Okay. So. Oh. Right back. Okay. So. We were here and we are just going to. <laughs> what was. Is this monopropellant? Okay, no it isn't. Good. That would have been bad. Um, what engine are we going to put on the bottom of this? It has to be able to stop it. This is the efficient one. So we'll use that. And we're going to put little landing legs on it. Hopefully we have bigger landing legs. Um, are these landing legs big enough? Yes, they actually are. Okay, so that looks good to start. Um, is there anything I'm missing here? These so that if it's night we can see the ground easily. So we can land. And... Oh, yes. When we're going up, we're going to have the problem of the atmosphere getting better at this remembering this stuff okay so that'll protect it going up because of that we're probably going to need some struts holding that on no worries you've got that covered and is there anything oh some of those aren't connecting so let's uh, fix that Let's do this. Is 
There we go, that looks good. Will this still extend with that there? It may look ridiculous, but it does. Okay, so are we missing anything on this lander? We've got fuel, legs, all that stuff. I mean, this isn't going to come back. We're just going to leave this. Cool. Um, oh, we are missing something. We want... You know, those aren't actually going to make that much of a difference, will they? We'll just put some RCS on this. Some fuel. Uh, do we have any RCX? RCS, not X. Um, RCS fuel. I'm not sure we do. Oh, here we go. we put this no I think we're fine this has inline re uh, reaction wheels built in and we will be able to steer with this okay so we're going to pull these up and we are going to start designing the rest of the rocket this is going to need to push it to the moon so this is going to have to be pretty powerful Good. This will be interesting. Now this time let's wait until the moon is lined. Oh wait, we don't really have to do that, do we?
here we go. So before we launch, let's do a quick check of everything. Yep, these are turning. Slight problem. These ones don't have fins. So we're going to recover this. Get our money back. Hopefully it gives us all of it back. Yeah, it gives us all of it back. And we're just going to quickly uh, throw some fins on. Two right there. And two right there. That looks good. Okay. So once again, a quick check to make sure we didn't forget anything. All those are working fine. SAS online. Gas all the way up. Three, two, one. <laughs> Lift off. So the two side ones will slowly get less heavy as the fuel goes down, which will make them eventually go more and more efficient. And then once they are gone, we're going to drop them and we'll still have this full thing of fuel with the other big engine. In theory, it should work well. Or it should work well in theory. It doesn't really matter what way you say it. I'm worried that we're using too much. But who knows? Yeah, we really are not gaining acceleration very quickly. It is safely bringing us up, though. It's uh, going at a pretty steady pace. We haven't even had a problem with the ablator. Heat. Oh, now we're starting to speed up a bit. Okay, this is actually a very peaceful launch. <laughs> Nothing's going wrong. The rocket isn't like flipping over. We're going to stop it here. Give it a minute to reach a better spot. Which is the apoapsis, and we are going to stop right about here. Turn. Very slowly turn. Oh, let's just turn this on. We're going to begin burning to make our orbit nice and round. Oh, and that's very fast. Drop those off. And we're still going very fast. And we've got lots of fuel left. So we are falling, but we'll be fine. Just wait. It's 
so peaceful in space. <laughs> because in space, no one can hear you scream. Most used quote ever. Okay, and we're just going to stop that. See how much fuel we have left? Not a ton. That's okay. This is really only to get us to the moon. If we wanted, we could just do that mission there. Um, But we aren't going to because that is not what we're here for. Apparently, we are actually in the atmosphere right here. But that's not a huge problem. We will be fine. It's pulling us down from the air resistance a bit. But we are going to be A-OK. -okay, I think. I mean, things can always go wrong, but... Do do do. I'm getting a very bad feeling we're not gonna make it to the moon. <laughs> I this these fuel levels do worry me. We don't have to make it back though, which is a plus. Okay, we're in orbit now. It says we're in orbit. Let us go faster. Nope, it's not going to let us go faster until we get a bit higher. Ah, here we go. Once the music starts, you know you've done it right. I'm going to swing it around right uh, once again, and we're going to aim just about here-ish. So that means... That looks about good to me. And to turn by burning a tiny bit. And that's in the wrong direction, so we're going to burn a tiny bit more to get a little bit more speed. We don't want to wait too long or we will miss our window of opportunity. <laughs> And here we are. Oh. And we are a okay until the fuel runs out. That just means we're going to have to move into our last engine, which actually isn't that slow. Oh, we're going to be fine, I think. I think. <laughs> just keep saying I think, so that if I mess up, I can be like, well, I only thought it would be okay. <laughs> this thing definitely has a little bit more punch than I thought it would have. a punch. Okay. That looks good to me. Now let's move. We're going to slow down. Oh, this is perfect. Beautiful. Okay, so... I've done this enough times now, I know how. <laughs> we just do this, spin around very quickly, and we burn this way. This is going to make this into a nice orbit. Nice circular orbit. And 
and there we go. So, we are going to modify this a bit. So that we fall at the absolute slowest possible. I wonder if this is enough fuel. <laughs> it's kind of worrying. Oh, we have to use barely any to make huge changes, though. I think we're going to be fine. Look at how little we're using. <laughs> Right now we're just going to make it so that we don't have to use as much speed to slow ourselves down the whole way. Because I don't know how much fuel we're going to have to use to land, so we're going to try to use the least. Okay, so let's uh, take one of our temperature measurements now. It is worth absolutely nothing. Let's see if the mystery goo is worth anything. Nope. Okay. Step. Uh, so. Step two. Is, um. Get closer. Which we're doing right now. Going around. And let's see if this is considered close now. Nope, it's still considered high over. Well, we're definitely going to get closer in a second. Just burning to spin myself around makes a big difference to the orbit. Okay. So we're slowing ourselves down a bit. And we're going to land right... there-ish. So let's see how close we're getting. Once we're at 50,000, I think we'll be safe to, um, try the close one. This is close enough. Literally close enough. Um, log temperature near the moon. It's actually still worth nothing. Oh well, it'll be worth it once we're on the moon. I'm sure. Okay. So we are gaining speed like is expected. Now we're going around to the bright side. And now we're going to begin to burn to not crash into the moon. Oh, dang it. Kind of messed that up a little bit. So we're just going to burn this way. And we're going to be fine. I love saying that. <laughs> we are going to be A-OK. -okay. We have plenty of fuel. We are not falling very quickly. turn so that we are landing straight up and down okay we're going to quickly open all these landing legs so that we're facing in the right direction. And here we go. Final descent. This is the first time we've landed on the moon. We should be proud. So let's speed this up a little bit. 
Once we hit about 5,000, we are going to start burning. We're going to go right in the crater. Let's slow ourselves down a bit. Also fix this so we aren't going at an angle. This is extremely exciting. <laughs> this is it. See all the rocks. Okay. It's like we ran out of fuel and electricity right now. This would be the worst. Oh, sorry if you can hear the dog barking. Yeah, you can definitely hear it now. Great. Amazing moment. Had to be ruined. No, I'm joking, it isn't really ruined. Man, you can really notice the uh, movement now. Oh. There we go, I got rid of a bit of it. And touch down. Um, it did minimize for a second there, so there's a little bit of a uh, thing. But we uh, landed. Yeah. Awesome. Now we're going to transmit all this great data we've got. We have landed on the moon, which has rewarded us with probably a lot of uh, sci uh, no, a science, but 205,000. Awesome. 18 science, 46, um, whatever, reputation. We're going to look at the temperature. Send this over. We could actually attempt to make it back. There's not much fuel, but it may be possible. Oh. Oh. We don't have any parachutes, though, which is a bit of a problem. Yeah, we're just going to leave this here. Maybe sometime we can recover it with something else. Who knows? Okay, that's worth nothing now. Did we use the... Oh, no, we didn't. Tons of science. Just so much. Okay, and we're going to do the final few things that we have left to do. Oh, whatever, 1.1, that's fine. Cool. And that's it. We have landed something on the moon. It's here, it's taking scientific data and stuff. That's it. Eat that, moon. We've won. <laughs> okay, let's go to the Space Center and uh, see how much science we have after that. Oh my. 150.
Ah, not enough to get heavier rocket reef, but we need more to get anyway. Okay, so we can get advanced construction, which may be pretty nice, or we could get aerodynamics. I'm not very worried about that. Planes get people killed too much. Control. Space exploration. Once again, this doesn't seem too important. Miniaturization. So, advanced flight control or advanced construction. I think we are going to go with... Yes, I think we are going to go for the advanced construction. Bam. And we're going to purchase... Oh my god, that's pretty expensive. Um. Oh yeah, we can see all the science we've gone from everything. Moon. Yep. Uh, so we did it. We landed on the moon. Oh, and the things actually did land there, so... Thank God we put the, uh, what's it called on them? Oh no, it actually, like, is debris. <laughs> oh, those are the things that held the thing up. That makes more sense. Okay, so what do we do now? Um, we actually do not have a pilot. So, uh, let's hire her. We do have signs. So now we have all of them. And... Wow, we actually did it. Well, guys, we will do more next episode. But thank you for watching. Like and subscribe if you want more. And, yeah. We landed on the moon. May not have been a manned landing but it's a step a step in the right direction cool